It only takes one geometrical shape to form laterally in the universe, and we never process that form's complexity. On the International Space Station, a candle flame will form a sphere. I will show a short video clip of this now. Therefore we can see that light radiates out spherically, in spherical waves. This geometry will be relative to the radius of the sphere, r squared, because the process unfolds relative to the surface of the sphere. The centre of the sphere will naturally form the three dimensions of everyday life. You can imagine a the three dimensions within the centre of the sphere. Each point on the wave front forms the potential for a new spherical wave front. We can think of each point as a photon of energy. The actual spherical surface, two-dimensional surface, forms a manifold for positive and negative charge. And we can see, it's logical, it's, it's at right angles. So the energy exchange will be at right angles, always based on spherical geometry. We have uncertainty between position and momentum as the wave radiates out. This can be seen as Heisenberg's uncertainty principle between energy and momentum. And we see 4 pi in the equation representing the spherical geometry. We can also reformulate this between energy and time because it's based on photon energy and the process forms a passage of time. Therefore we have uncertainty between energy and time. This uncertainty will be equal to always greater than the Planck constant divided by 2 pi. 2 pi representing the circumference of the sphere, the smallest part of the process, forms the Planck constant, the Planck divided by 2 pi. It's very logical. In my next video, I will show how this spherical symmetry can break, forming the most beautiful of geometrical shapes, the Fibonacci spiral. Please sub and share, it will help the promotion of this theory. Thanks for watching.